Uh, this uh, it will be like part two, but tomorrow I'm gonna put the both clips together, so it's gonna be all one video. But this is like part two of this human excrement from Ljubljana, who dared to regard himself to me as a police investigator during the so-called MK Ultra procedure. This human excrement have allowed himself to death threaten me in front of neighbor here, police investigator, Method Yerman. He had the investigators from Nova Mesta police, individual who I have met at the police station, actually a criminal who met me at the police station when I came to inquire about assistance in respect to father is medical files. Another individual who traced me to Velike Brusnice sometimes in 2022 with blue Volkswagen Golf station wagon. Uh, these are the criminals that were involved in this few here from the novel Mesto. But what makes this human excrement from Ljubljana so special is that he demanded from me to the what can I tell you? That's why I call him a human excrement. I mean, I'm not referring to him as a, obviously not as a police investigator or as a human being, but human excrement. I'm not going to say accept because how can you accept human ex? How can you how can you accept excrement that looks like a human being? How can you accept offers from human excrement? I don't think you can do that. From the dunk from Ljubljana, eventually insisted me that if I would not accept his offers, he would I'm not going to say make me problems, but let really get me incarcerated. Eventually, that he would get me even killed. Then, realizing that this thing is not going to go along very well. He would have two other police officers that would join him in front of me. He was making them requests, is suggesting me that I am violent. You know, imagine being drugged up, tortured, and suggested in front of police officers how they're going to investigate your case. A <laughs> uh, case which you're going to go entirely through and do everything by yourself. And gather all the data that you collected and that's going to be then based on their decision it's going to be the investigation then. that's how it's going to be the investigation uh, he is blunt and he is probably about 185 maybe even 190 centimeters tall medium build and as far as the age just about my age, I would say. I am 52. And I don't know. This guy might be, might be 55, might be 45. I do not know. Somewhere difficult to judge somewhat when you are drugged up. Uh, keep in mind, since 2020, it's now, believe it or not, it's 2024. It's hard for me to even believe this stuff. I haven't been drugged up, I haven't been hijacked. So, um, you're talking about what, eight, seven years ago, back in time, six years ago, time flies faster than you would think. Uh, and then that can make a big age, maybe even appearance difference. It doesn't matter. He's from Ljubljana. He played on a Milan Kuchan card, knowing that um, how are you going to go and 
view somebody like Milan Kudrin in my case or Borat Pahor in my case or people basically who acted like an extension of Yossi Bros Tito with sole intent to exterminate me to delete me from the face of earth these are the people who classified me as undocumented basically as non-existing explaining me that I exist in national register that I do have my tax ID and everything social security number like everybody else uh, can go to the stores can go everywhere uh, job wise nothing like basically you don't exist anywhere you live in the world parallel to the world where people live basically I <laughs> I am not gonna go into these issues uh, he knew everything about my case he was involved for a very long time in it and proceeded to suggest that because maybe i should use him anyways that i should definitely use him because of the people like yanko because people like yanko and psychiatrist peter kops they played a card like uh presented themselves to those involved in mk ultra as a communists as a leftists as a, uh, those that support equality in this world they express strong support for equal rights for equality but also for other issues that they already have discussed on the blog because the main idea of British Royals was to play me to make like a double front right uh, on one side, Slovenian, Josip Bros Tito, and on the other side, British, American, and so on. So, each, each way you're going to go is basically a knife under the ribs. They all work together more than, obviously, psychiatrist Peter Kops was trained by the Central Intelligence Agency. I'm going to have a beautiful video coming about how they uh, was a family in the U.S., it's actually a video they released how uh, a killer filmed uh, his victims being killed and it's quite ridiculous because that family started uh, the massacres like you see on a blue on a big screen already in 2005 and it all came out like in 2012 I mean 2004 2003 2004 and it all came out like almost 10 years later uh and again i was guilty i was the one who refused to have absolutely anything i rated them as unacceptable as ugly uh i was the one who was guilty to cause them depression suffering because of the way i didn't want to marry and daughter and finally even as the husband insisted his wife yeah and it was a psychiatrist peter Kops, who always contrary to me have offered them uh, a free consultation and mental support this guy was literally trained to murder to kill by central intelligence agency in the united states of america have participated on thousand cases on thousand occasions american police central intelligence had him throughout the united states of america and have trained him they gave him a traits of the terrorist of the trained terrorist trained central intelligence agency terrorist another thing is he was educated by the london board of psychiatrists royal board of psychiatrists royal association of psychiatrists from london whatever it is i did already post a link to that issue uh he had with the leftists with the communists he does have as much as the last year as much as i have to do with the last year snow so well, these are important factors to discuss before we move on so this police officers this police blonde police officer was to act like a liaison between me and between young co psychiatrist cops and uh the leftist police officers that embarrassed absolutely everybody that was whatever i'm gonna say 
uh, oriented. These people had nothing to do with any justice. They were obviously trained assassins, criminals, and not police investigators, police officers, whatever. Not even, I don't even, like I said, I don't see them as a people. And so this guy was to, to, um, to demonstrate them in my head. That's how he wanted to portray me during MK Ultra with the psychiatrist, cultural police, and all that. They started, they, they made like a play, like a game with belief that I'm going to see how he's going to be fighting for the rights of the blonde Slovenian people. I'm not blonde, but I would go in that category and he would come to rescue to me and it would be the right thing to do so they could see that there is in Slovenia also blonde. When it comes to blonde issue, wearing the Nike shoes, wearing the Adidas shoes, driving Mercedes or BMW or Volkswagen, anything that would be that would have to do with German or even Hewlett Packard or uh, whatever, using a computer, whatever it would be that you would be using, like Western, this was all Nazi. Everything was Nazi, Nazi, Nazi. Um, the idea was to build this uh, idea in my head to make me sick because I had to be guilty for absolutely everything, for British royals to look at this somewhat credible due to their, well, neo-Nazi history, their involvement into neo-Nazi issues. Uh, I had to be the one, I had to be the one embracing uh, whatever uh, they would be using me, basically whatever they use me for to look in a different light in front of the world, right? Because that's basically, I absorbed all the negative energy from this world and they were next to me, I was next to them like a dung, and they were next to me like a shine of hope, shine of light throughout the world, basically, whatever I traveled with them or whenever somebody inquired about my bad behavior, then they demonstrated him given the ability to torture, to disperse his anger, whatever, on me, and so on, so that it would for the better for the just world. Okay? Because this is how they rule from London. Uh, so this guy, uh, in he wanted to create in my head, together with the psychiatrist Peter Kapsch, uh, sickness that, through the mental illness, I would accept him as the one that will actually come on a picture in... Uh, avenge me basically in my name blonde guy slovenian guy would go and would go and would investigate and so on but god forbid that you would go uh, and according to his words stand him on a way he was at the home for elderly people where they had the father he already investigated over there he he had me next to him and basically trained me to accept this type of uh, whatever you want to call this mind game mental illness basically is how i see this as believe that he was uh, superior in his ways that he handles me that he will handle this whole thing so i just want to finish about this human experiment this is a part number two uh, he said uh, already at the beginning i don't know that he's gonna get me uh, destroyed uh, if I would ever even say anything or whatever and so on so he can sure expect me at the beginning already I will be looking for you buddy in Ljubljana there is absolutely no doubt about it I will be looking for you at your police station where you had me you know at your department where you had these tables it was it was quite big it was quite I don't know what that was, but it was a lot of tables, it was quite big. So I think you are from the main police stations come back. And we're going to see each other pretty damn soon.